I put the preheater for the feed water heater, feed water heater, I guess, a preheater, inside the burner lining. You can see it, it's just this, this, these two right there, these two, in and out. It goes right in around. I had to drop it down. I had to drop it down here. Steering arm's hitting. Um, so I had to make it a little lower there. It's going to be, you know, it's still going to be insulated, but that's going to be inside the insulation. No insulation between it and the stainless liner. I usually try to keep it about an inch from the top down. Um, there's the um, vaporizer. It's stainless, 4130 heat sink. There's the branch work. Like I said, it needs cleaned up and painted, but uh, no leaks. Everything seems to going to be work. Going to work. So, got to, like I said, straighten the top of the burner paint burner off. Oh, there's that. That's uh, Stanley seam that they did. With four four mounting brackets. Like I said, I just got to put a liner in here, clean it up, and uh, that's the preheater. Feed water heater, preheater. Uh, before the water goes into the boiler. So, like I said, I had to keep it down lower, like I said, here a little bit for the fellow steering arm. But, uh, that's it. Uh, I think there's eight feet, eight feet right in there, one wrap right around. Awful close, so. Okay, hey, thanks.